Autumn marks the cricket fighting season in Beijing, a traditional Chinese sport with over 1,000 years of history. Similar to cockfighting, the traditional Chinese cricket fight involves two crickets duking it out within a fixed ring. Man Zhi Guo, a part-time cricket fighting fanatic and full-time truck driver, has been raising and fighting crickets for over 40 years. The 54-year-old has a diverse collection of more than 70 crickets from across China, some worth over 10,000 won or 1,600 U.S. dollars apiece. Each of his specimens lie nestled in modest clay jars along the shelves of his cricket room in a traditional Beijing courtyard. Man feeds his crickets a mixture of bean paste and water as part of their high-protein diet and trains them regularly. This was all in preparation for this year's National Cricket Fighting Championships, which were held in Beijing during the Golden Week holiday in the first week of October. The cricket fight itself requires the handlers to poke and prod at the insects with a piece of hay or small stick to irritate them. A judge then removes a divider between the two crickets from the ring and the insects are free to fight each other. Judges follow a set of strict guidelines and rules, most of which date back to the 13th century, for determining match points. Loud chirps indicate when the crickets have been significantly angered, but conjoling them into fighting is not easy. Points are then tallied by which aggressive cricket was able to overcome the other, but unlike cockfighting, the matches rarely result in fatal injuries for the insects. Crickets have a short lifespan, often not more than 100 days. China's major cricket fighting competition is held when crickets are in their prime in the autumn. This year, over 20 teams from provinces across the country competed in the two-day championships. Man's cricket did not lose a single match, but his team finished fourth overall.